The city fired an APD officer who crashed into a family's car, killing a young boy. Now, the city is shelling out millions to settle a lawsuit over that crash. News 13's Chris McKee has details. We pulled over because the officer was down. Witnesses won't forget the crash. Someone yelled, we have to get the kids out of the car. And the kids were both trapped in the, in the back seat. Mom was in, still in the front seat crying, trying, telling us to get her kids out. April 2017, APD officer Jonathan McDonald's APD cruiser crashed at the intersection of Eubank and Indian School, hitting Antoinette Sweena's car with her two kids inside. Five-year-old Joel Anthony Sweena died. He was a lovable, joyful little boy. The family sued for wrongful death this year. Investigators found the now-fired McDonald was driving with lights and sirens nearly 80 miles an hour toward a call about a man threatening people with a machete. I do understand with hindsight that my speed was excessive. Newly filed court documents show a settlement in the case. The city will pay $3.8 million to the Sweena family, the second multi-million dollar settlement it's paid for an APD officer's driving in recent years. Ashley Browder's family was paid $8.5 million last year for the deadly 2012 crash with a former APD officer, Adam Casaus. That settlement included a memorial plaque and also forced APD to teach new officers driver training and awareness about the crash. The Sweena family's attorney says they're pursuing similar measures as part of their settlement to honor Joel Anthony. He would want us to live life to the fullest. Chris McKee, KRQE News 13. Those additional settlement details are still being ironed out. Sweena's attorney says they are continuing to meet with APD on a final agreement.